Hi kindergartners and other friends. Let's work on our word wall words. First we're going to start out by just reviewing them quickly. I'll say them, put them down, and you repeat them. Then we'll play a little game with them. Here. They. Soon. Up. Will. Your. Be. Into. Where. Come. Now. With. Me. Are. My. We, what, many, on, the, to, like, and, see, I, A, U, who, but, this, is, that, how, find, Go, so, from, came, of. And here are some of our new ones that I've just been introducing to you. Say, play, new, Make them, and today we're going to learn this word. This is the word give, G-I-V-E, give. Spell it with me, G-I-V-E, give. All right. The game we're going to play is I Spy. So I'm going to lay four word wall words out in front, and then I'll give you some clues, and you see if you can figure out which word I'm talking about. All right. Take a look at those four words. We have the word and, like, your, be. Listen to my first clue. I spy with my little eye a word wall word that has four letters. Hmm, do you see two words that we can get rid of? And only has three letters, so it can't be that one. B only has two letters, so it can't be that word. Now we're down to your and like. It's hard to guess which one I spy yet because my only clue was it has four letters and both of those words have four letters. So listen to my next clue. I spy with my little eye a word that has four letters and one of those letters is a basement letter. Hmm. What is your answer? That's right. The word I spied was your. Y is a basement letter. It goes down below all the other letters. Like doesn't have any basement letters. Let's try again. All right, the four words that I have now are of, came, from, how. My first clue is 
My I spy a word wall word that has three letters. Can you figure out which word I spy? Good job. It was the word how. How is the only word that had three letters. Of has two, came has four, and from has four letters, but how only had three. Good guessing. Let's play one more time. This time I'm going to use our new words. I have give, them, make, and play. Uh-oh. What do you notice about all four of those words? They all have four letters going to make your guessing a little bit trickier. All right. I spy with my little eye a word that has a tall letter and a basement letter. Look carefully. It has to have a tall letter and a basement letter. You're right. I spied the word play. Play has a tall letter L and a basement letter Y. Good guessing. All right, let's take a closer look at that word give. Give is spelled with four letters. It is G, I, V, E. Give. We can hear those sounds, G, I, V. But then it has this extra E on the end that we can't hear. G, I, V E spells give. Achoo! Oh no, I messed up all the letters. Now it doesn't spell give anymore. Hmm, I wonder what letter comes first. G, G. That's right, first the G. G, I, I. There's that itchy I. G, I, V. And then that E on the end. G. I V E spells give. Oh no, I messed up the word give again. All right, let's see. Last time, see if you can help me. What letter do I need first? That's right. G G I I I G I V and then that E G. I V E spells give. Good job. Let's read a couple sentences with the word give. I can give you my Sandwich. Read it with me. I can give you my sandwich. Nice reading. Try to read my sentence now. Good job. Read it with me. I can give you my flower. Let's do another one. Read that sentence. Good. Let's read it together. I can give you my doll. How about this one? That sentence says, I can give you my robot. Last one. Go ahead and read it. Well done. Let's read it together. I can give you my shoes.
Good reading. All right. Last thing we're going to do is do some sentences. So here's where you'll need a piece of paper and a pencil. Remember, it can be any kind of paper that you have, even one with no lines, if you don't have any with lines. And get something to write with. Pencil is best so you can make some changes with an eraser, but anything that you have will work. I'm going to say a sentence, and I want you to write all the words that you hear in that sentence. So the first sentence is, I can give you the hot pot. Ready? I, write that word. Remember to write nice and neat so we can all read it. Leave a space and write the word can. Think about the sounds you hear in can. Leave a space and write the word give. Give was our new word wall word. See if you can remember the sounds and that extra sneaky letter at the end. Give. Leave a space. Write the word you. Leave a space. Write the word the. Good, now leave a space and write the word hot. Stretch it out and listen to all the sounds that you hear in hot. It has that new letter we've been practicing, the ah sound in the middle. Last word, leave a space and write the word pot. Pot. Good, that's the end of the first sentence, so remind Remember to put a little period at the end of that sentence. The second sentence says, I see the big frog on a log. Start with the word I. Good job. Leave a space and write the word see. Leave a space and write the word the. Leave a space and write all the sounds you hear in big. Be careful with that letter B. Big. Leave another space and write the word frog. Frog. Listen carefully. There are four sounds in frog. See if you can find all four of them and write them down. Leave a space and write the word on. On. Leave a space and write the word a. And then your last word is the word log. Say all the sounds and write them on your paper log. All right, I'm going to write those sentences so that you can see them. Check yours and see how you did. I can and give g if, and then there's that E at the end that we can't hear. You the hot ah, uh, there's that O. Hot. Good job. The second sentence said, I see the 
the big b. Remember, b goes this way. We start with the stick and then the bubble. I, g, frog, fr, og, on, on, a, oh, og. Good job. I'm going to add two quick pictures. Here is that hot pot with the steam coming out. And then I'm going to make a nice big frog. Here's the webbed feet. And he's going to be sitting on a log. Good writing. Keep practicing. Bye.